This is a dish that has absolutely nothing from the sea in it, but it tastes like the sea because of these salted capers right here. The ones under vinegar don't taste good. The ones with salt, they taste like the sea. It's amazing. First thing we want to do is sort of rinse them of all the salt because they have a lot of salt. So here's just a little bit of warm water. And just while we're prepping everything, those guys can hang out right there. All right, so here's the thing. You cut off the, the prickly end there, and what we want to do is just get long slices here so that we can grill them. I didn't really like to eat fish until I was like 14 years old. Same with chocolate. I love fish now. And some Greek feta cheese. How this is Italian? Well, you know, our conception of what Italian is is totally thrown off by maybe what Italian American is. But remember, Italy is pretty close to Greece. The South does stuff totally different than the North. Feta is a cheese that they use in Puglia, in Calabria, and parts of Sicily. They certainly use oregano. Where is the oregano, by the way? I need that. I'm gonna put oil in this pan now. And I'm not putting anything on the eggplant. See it's smoking right away? We don't need any salt because the capers are super salty. Okay, so we're just gonna flip these over. Whoa, nice. Nice color there. So the mountains around the southern part of Italy have oregano growing wild and I've taken hikes there and you, and you smell it. I pick it off the tree and eat it. So even though it's not from the sea, it's by the sea and it's a delicious flavor. I think in America we mostly think of it as just a Greek thing, but it's just not true. So tons and tons of this, the fresh stuff from the leaves, it's amazing. Oh yeah. So we're getting nice marks here, gorgeous. Put a little more oregano on. Nothing on these really other than oil. They're gorgeous. We'll put them out. Boom. 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 Okay, while this is hot, what we want to do. That's a good ratio right there. Like 50% eggplant, 25 cheese and tomato. All right, so now we need to rinse our capers. And now they're nice and clean. You can see they're it's void of all salt particles and more reconstituted. This is our salt right here. So you gotta go by taste. Use good judgment. A mixing bowl here. Oh, oh, just take one. Mm. Smoky grill. I need more sea. This is the sea, remember the taste of the sea because we're doing the Vegetarian sea salad. More oregano. Get it everywhere. <laughs> it tastes better that way, I swear. <laughs> Parsley. Throw that in there. Basil. Could you add pasta to it? Absolutely, absolutely you could add pasta to it. It's delicious. But you gotta put raw oil. Raw extra virgin olive oil is like the whole thing. It's not the same as cooking with it. It doesn't taste as good. This is now a fresh taste. This is a radicchio. Raw oil, fresh herbs, salinity from the feta, saltiness and oceanness from the capers. And then fresh fruit. Fresh fruit, tomatoes. It's really good as a pasta as well, truthfully. And that's it. Your salad of the sea with no fish.